country is awaiting the ruling on whether President Donald Trump must disclose his financial information as part of New York investigations into fraud. In her Tuesday show, MSNBC's Rachel Maddow explained that she has been through Trump's niece's book from COVID to cover and encouraged people to look at page 185, where Mary Trump details how she ended up speaking to the New York Times about the financial records of Trump and his father. Advertisement According to the story, Times reporter Suzanne Craig appeared at Mary Trump's door asking about the information. Mary explained that she didn't have any of the documents, but Craig suggested that their lawyer might, hobbling on crutches after breaking her fifth metacarp. Mary Trump went to the lawyer's office where she slipped papers, discs and notes into her bag. Over the subsequent weeks, the younger Trump gathered boxes of information that she delivered under a bridge to an SUV with a rained ear nose and antlers on it. Over time, Mary Trump discovered that her uncle and aunt had taken all of the money from Fred Trump and siphoned all his money out of accounts and into trusts. My grandfather's estate had actually been worth close to $1 billion, $1 billion when he died, I just didn't know it yet, wrote Mary Trump. After I was sure, the lawyer, had gone, I grabbed copies of my grandfather's wills, floppy disks with all the depositions from the lawsuits and some of my grandfather's bank records, all of which I was legally entitled to as part of the lawsuit. See the full detailing of the story in the video below, advertisement, enjoy good journalism. Then let us make a small request. The Covid crisis has cut advertising rates in half, and we need your help. Like you, we here at Raw Story believe in the power of progressive journalism. Raw Story readers power David K. Johnston's DC report, which we've expanded to keep watch in Washington. We've exposed billionaire tax evasion and uncovered White House efforts to poison our water. We've revealed financial scams that prey on veterans, and legal efforts to harm workers exploited by abusive bosses. And unlike other news outlets, we've decided to make our original content free. But we need your support to do what we do. Raw Story is independent. Unbinged from corporate overlords, we fight to ensure no one is forgotten. We need your support in this difficult time. Every reader contribution, whatever the amount, makes a tremendous difference. Invest with us. Make a one-time contribution to Raw Story Investigates, or click here to become a subscriber, thank you. Click to donate by check. Value Raw Story? Then let us make a small request. The Covid crisis has cut advertising rates in half, and we need your help. Like you, we believe in the power of progressive journalism, and we're investing in investigative reporting as other publications give it the axe. More story readers power David K. Johnston's DC report, which we've expanded to keep watch in Washington. We've exposed billionaire tax evasion and uncovered White House efforts to poison our water. We've revealed financial scams that prey on veterans, and efforts to harm workers exploited by abusive bosses. We need your support to do what we do. Raw Story is independent. You won't find mainstream media bias here. Every reader contribution, whatever the amount, makes a tremendous difference. Invest with us in the future. Make a one-time contribution to Raw Story Investigates, or click here to become a subscriber. Thank you. Report typos and corrections to email protected. Let's block ads. Show your love for him. Click the link in description. Thanks for watching.